my trailer is gonna be on, up on that sidewalk. Oh. How's it going, internet? I am finally back with a new episode. I'm really excited about that. I hope you guys had a wonderful 4th of July. I have, I took four days off, got a little bit of a break from this trucking hustle, spent some time with my family. We had a lot of fun. I left Rochester, New York this morning with a load going to Ludlow, Vermont that I had to deliver at 1 p.m. It was a good day right up until the point where I was told I wouldn't be making it home tonight. So check it out. make a quick pit stop here at the service area I have not had my coffee or breakfast this morning and I'm in dire need of both all right got some coffee and a biscuit let's keep on rolling I'm in traffic now. There was an accident up ahead on I-87 on, I on the twin bridges there coming out of uh, Albany. There's a sign that said use alternate routes. I don't really know an alternate route, so it looks like I'm gonna be stuck in this traffic for a while. No, but I'm going north. Anybody know what's going on? That's what I was trying to figure out. There's a wreck on the bridges. Appreciate it, driver. You want over, big truck? What that yellow truck is doing is illegal, but I totally get them. All these people wait to the last minute to merge, and then just, that's why we're not moving at all. There you go. Somebody knows what a blinker is. There you go. There you go. Use that blinker. the interstate for now uh, the remaining 72 miles to my delivery is gonna be just country roads and uh, small towns coming into a little town of Ludlow, Vermont. I'm assuming they get quite a bit of tourists here in the winter. There's a ski resort here to my right and some ski slopes that you can actually see if you're coming the other way. Unfortunately, I gotta take a detour, looks like. Let's see, truck detour. They've got a bridge up ahead that's closed that's completely shut down to traffic and I am just 
a few miles away from my destination. Oh, this is gonna be tight. Yeah, fellas, I'm gonna need you all to clear out. Go ahead. Oh, this does not look nice. Trailer's gonna be on, up on that sidewalk. Oh. Not too bad. I'm sure this is not a truck crowd, but there's no other way to get to uh, my destination here. I'm just a mile and a half away. I hope they get that bridge uh, taken care of fairly soon because we tend to come up here quite often. This load that I'm delivering uh, it comes out of uh, comes out of Oklahoma and we get it every time on our way back from Texas. And every now and then I get to be the one delivering it. Mm, yeah, this is tight. Awesome, I get to go through a little residential neighborhood. This was always on my bucket list. Alright, here we go. Made it to the destination. Small little factory here that makes some uh, windows and doors. And I am delivering some particle board for the insides. Let's go check in. Well, they're ready for me to get into a door, so let's do it. to get loaded got some yummy shish kebabs from the fourth left over that I'm gonna enjoy <laughs> there we go all right I'm finally unloaded let's get out of this dock call uh, headquarters and see what I'm doing next This isn't turning out well for me. I have just been informed that I'm gonna have to spend the night somewhere in the area here because they cannot find any loads going back, going back to our warehouse. There is nowhere to spend the night here in Ludlow. So now I am doubling back back the same way I came in this really really sucks for me and uh, I'm not too excited about that I am have to make a really wide turn here because this is a uh, this intersection is at an angle I'm still gonna hit that curb again no matter what I do give me just a second give me just a second I 
is this is where I'm gonna be spending the night at this five-star rest area so here I am at a rest area on the New York and Vermont border dispatch never did call me back with any pickup information so I guess I'll just have to check in in the morning and see where I'll be going next I'm gonna relax for the evening go back and edit this video that way I can upload it tomorrow I hope you've enjoyed this episode I'm trying out a new mic that I bought I'm just trying to get the uh, audio quality a little better get the voice clarity going through I mean there's still a little bit of noise from the truck I don't think I can help that but we'll see how it sounds once I start editing the video if you're new to the channel I encourage you to subscribe either by hitting the button down below or you can hit on the logo that pops up at the end of this video like the video leave a comment and I'll see you guys next time whatever you're driving guys be safe out there peace <laughs>